Happy Family Day and good afternoon, everyone. John Abbott, Bob McGill with you on Rogers TV for the Toronto Marlies and Houston Arrows this afternoon. Starting goaltender for Houston, Matt Hackett. Record of 16, 17, and 3. A 2.63 goals against average, 908 save percentage. He is 0-1 versus the Marlies this season. In the Toronto end, making a second straight start in the second straight game, Drew McIntyre off of a victory in his first game. A 1 goals against average and a 944 save percentage. He was brilliant in a 2-1 Toronto win on Saturday. In his own zone is Genoway. That'll be played. Connolly. The Marlies trying to track it back. Does to the point. Geisper's rising shot went up over top of the goal. Well, he sounded like he clipped the crossbar there, John. I thought it hurt some iron. Gardner skates away coolly from Coyle. He seems to be able to spin off players at his own will. Uh, he's getting that stride back. Here's a chance for Gardner, and it's stopped by Hackett at the top of his crease. It'll be Rowe into the around, excuse me, far side wall, and set up there for one timer, but sliding across his McIntyre to make the save. Gardner wheels around the net. Now Connolly, left wing circle. That's where he's used to setting up. Connolly exchanges passes with Gardner. Down low to Zigmanis in the pipe for Hamilton, and his spin around backhander broken up. Colburn saved it. Now he's got the puck in tight. Hamilton, hot stop. Left wing circle. Connolly with it. 5 on 3 Toronto is 29 seconds. Connolly off the goal post. He hammered it into the pipe to the right of Hackett. Uh, Motto. At center, takes away from Peterson, but he's caught behind the rush. Now he'll catch up as Bayeu played it across, and a pad stopped by McIntyre. He's got the rebound, and another save from McIntyre, who then gets pulled over. And after three good saves, McIntyre has got some traffic on top of him. Coyle to Rao, 2 on 1 Houston. Rao broken up as Dylan Yo comes back to get a stick in the lane. That'll be a slapper into McIntyre. He'll stop that one. One second left in the period, and that will tick away. And the first period ended in a scoreless tie. The second period will as well. The center and the Marlies complete their change. Medbeck rattled up by Crescenzi. And the penalty glass in front of the box took a thump and two. Into the slot, Gardner lost it. Rebound, they'll score. Rao will take the puck away from a ricochet off Gardner, and Houston has the first goal of the hockey game. They shoot it past Kenny Ryan, and as a result, he can't keep it in, but it's tried to gloved by uh, Jake Gardner. He gets it in the palm of his glove, but then he's got to put it down, and he loses control, and Chad Rao jumps on top of that loose puck, and his seventh of the season stakes the Houston Arrows to a 1-0 lead here with 10.36 to play. At the Rico Coliseum. Gardner tries to spin away. Tight ropes the blue line to Blacker. His slapper off the leg of Merritt to the net. They score! Domingo chips it in. Tie game. Well, you talk about a game of bounces and. You know, Jerry D'Amigo, Johnny on the spot, but fends off the defender, sauce pass backhand, the shot by Blacker, it goes off a defenseman's foot, off the end boards, and then Jerry D'Amigo just reaches in, or maybe Tim Connolly gets credited with it, but the overhead look, when the puck comes into sight, you see the stick come into play, and Tim Connolly's got white tape on his stick, and he chips it past the goaltender as the net comes up. And the Marlies tie it up. Up company Marlies, right wing side. Scott with Acton in all alone. And it zipped over his stick. Acton was in the clear. One minute gone through overtime. Toronto won and Houston won at Rico on family day. Stopped by Yo at his own blue line. Now they shop one on one. They shop. Toe drag and a shot goes off the stick into the mesh. Final minute to play. And overtime at Rico. Zigaman is left wing side to Hamilton. Hamilton comes in, fires, and it's puck in front. Now Mono finds it. Back to Zygamanis. At the tip of his stick, he put it high over top of the goal. Well, there's a chance he could face half as many shots in the shootout as he did in the game. Ryan Hamilton comes up to start for Toronto in the shootout. Pulls it wide. Now right down the pipe. Deeks and lost control at the last second after Hackett made a move. 
Now Houston's turn to shoot, and it's Phillips coming in. Phillips head fakes, sliding over to make the save. Is McIntyre. Oh, great job by McIntyre. As Zach Phillips comes in, just two goals on the season. He comes in, fakes the shot, goes to the backhand. Abbott waiting. Hits the green light. Spencer Abbott for the Marlies. Comes in straight away. Holds. Backhand scores! Easy as pie for Spencer Abbott. Coming in with it is McIntyre on McIntyre. And Houston's McIntyre will score to tie things up. Zigamanis comes in. Quickly on Hackett, slows it down, fires glove, saved by Hackett. McIntyre trying to shut it down for the Marlies. Peterson comes in and scores. The arrows prevail on the last shot of the hockey game to take it 2-1 over the Toronto Marlies.